Welcome Capricorn. Hey, this is Renee and welcome back. Today Capricorn, we're going to take a look at all about romance. What's going on with Capricorn's love life? What you can expect, what's happening, what's coming forward. What is going on Capricorn, right? So let's take a look. Now if this reading resonates, please like and subscribe. If it doesn't resonate, feel free to take a look at your other placements. And let's get some energy. Okay. So we have it safe for you to love. Be, and you know, open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. Right? So I feel like new love may be coming in for you. This could be the one. Your already met romantic partner you seek. So definitely this could be the one. This is... Maybe new love coming in, it feels like. It feels new. It feels refreshing. Okay, so let's get some more energy. More energy for Capricorn, please. Okay, so we have all as well. Archangel Jeremel. Everything is happening exactly as it's supposed to. With hidden blessings, you will soon understand Definitely, I feel like this is planned, right? We also have Take Back Your Power, Archangel Raziel. Use your God-given power and intention to manifest blessings in your life. Definitely, so something powerful is happening. Things are changing. Things are, are moving exactly the way it's supposed to, uh, exactly the way it's destined to. And I feel like something new is about to happen that is going to be very surprising to you. Okay, so we have between worlds. So here's the thing, Capricorn, the number three may be very significant to you, but I feel like these are changes. These are changes that are going to be happening. And it may be that you kind of caught between the past and the present. Or the past and the future, right? I feel like there may be things that you're mending, that you're trying to work out, that you're trying to fully understand. You may be going through some kind of healing at the moment from some kind of past energy or past events, okay? So the number 52 may also be very significant, okay? And let's see. Let's take a look at the love oracle let's see what's going on with capricorn what's going on in capricorn's love life what's going on in this connection messages for capricorn what's going on in this connection please lightning yeah sudden change surprises transformation so definitely you're going through changes you're going through transformation the, these things are happening um by surprise like i said the angels want to bring you blessings you, you know this may be something that you're really not anticipating so it's going to be a big surprise there's going to be some kind of seduction you know someone's very attracted to you there may be a lot of flirting between you and this person. There may be, you know, maybe you're going on a few dates. But I feel like there's this chemistry. There's this invigoration, right? And we have kisses. So this situation is going to turn into unconditional affection. Falling in love. You know, giving and receiving equal balance. Okay, so I feel like this person... Is going to kind of balance you out. Okay. So, so I definitely feel like you and this person are communicating. You may be going out on dates. You may be spending a lot of time together. But I feel like it's very uplifting. It's very joyful. And, you know, you're creating this, this friendship as well as lovers. There's obviously this attraction here. Um, and I feel like, you know... There's this chemistry that's kind of drawing you together. There's a lot of sexual chemistry between you and this person as well. Okay, so let's take a look at the romantic tarot. See what is going on for Capricorn. Messages for Capricorn, please. 
What do we have for Capricorn? Okay, so we have spiritual teacher, the number nine. Um, there are great rewards in spending time alone. Use those moments of solitude to focus on love and ways of which you might give to those around you. Shine your light as an example to others to follow. Seek out a spiritual mentor of your own if you if your life feels unfulfilled right now. So this is the hermit energy. You know, you may be looking for wisdom. You may be looking for some kind of guidance. Or you may be spending a lot of time a lot of time alone right now but I feel like this definitely changing we also have the three of abundance this is the three of Pentacles energy so I feel like you and this person you know you really want to uh, work together in your situation collaborate you know take things to the next level okay your passions will lead to your divine life purpose do what you love have confidence in your talent Learn everything there is to know about your interests by taking classes, getting a mentor, and teaming up with like-minded people. Allow your creativity to soar. Okay? We have the messenger of emotion. Definitely. So this is the um, Knight of Cups. Right? This is the beginning of a new emotional experience that could grow into something deeper. You may receive a message expressing feelings that you didn't even know were developing. A social invitation could be on its way to you. There's a person involved who's very gentle, loving, with only the kindest of int intentions. It could be you, especially if you're artistic, shy, and sensitive. Right, gonna get one more. We also have the guardian of abundance. So this is the king of uh, pinnacles energy. So there's definitely some kind of solid offer on the table. Someone wants to be very successful you, with you. They really value your connection and really see themselves putting in a lot of long-term energy into this situation, right? So this is a... Um, this is a time of great success for you. All your plans are blessed and will move forward perfectly. Unexpected job opportunities arise in the near future. Make sure that you accept them. This card indicates that someone with an amazing career is involved in the situation. This is a powerful person with great integrity who enjoys hard work. This person could be you, of course. Okay. So let's get some messages from this person. What would this person like to say to Capricorn? Give me some messages for Capricorn spirit. What would this person say to Capricorn? What would this person say to Capricorn, please? Messages for Capricorn. I will wait for a sign from you. See, we will be together again. I left when I saw you with someone. So I feel like this person has been through a few things, right? Um, I feel like this person may kind of be jealous of the jealous type. Um, I feel like this person really enjoys this connection but it may be time for them to heal as well right i wish things could be different so i, I really feel like this person isn't showing their true emotions they're kind of holding back in a way i feel like there's a lot of chemistry with this person but they're kind of you know I, I feel like they're they're very open and forthright at one moment and then they're kind of closed up the next and that may be because of issues they've been through in the past um yeah yeah because look at this i knew exactly what i was doing i don't react when people talk about you 
I am becoming a better person. I feel like this person feels like they're a better person when they're around you. I want to be more than friends. You know? I bury myself in work so that I don't think about you. You're the best thing in my life. Wow. Yeah, I feel like this person has very strong feelings. But I feel like, you know, they don't want to come across as, you know, being too much. Right? As kind of... If this is a guy, I feel like they, they have like this ego that they're trying to maintain. If this is a girl, I feel like, you know, they're trying to let you know that... You know, they're, they're strong. Like they have this strong will. But I feel like this person is obsessed with you. Will this pain ever stop? It hurts so much. Wow. You've triggered me. The passion is too much. Yeah, this person, oh my gosh, this passion between you and this person is just overwhelming. It's overwhelming for them. It's just like when they're around you, they just feel so deeply. And I feel like they're trying very hard not to let on that they feel as much as they do already, right? They're trying to make it look like they're going slow in the situation, like they're taking their time. But I feel like their emotions are just escalating. Their emotions are running really fast. They may not be telling you just how deeply they're falling for you, Capricorn. And I feel like they, this person is falling really, really hard. This person is falling for you very hard. I feel like they're just trying to kind of mask just how much they feel. They don't want you to know just yet. Give me more messages for Capricorn. Give me more messages for Capricorn, please. What does Capricorn need to know for this connection? What does Capricorn need to know? This is a soulmate. This is a soulmate connection, Capricorn. This person feels like you're the one. Like you're, look at this. Yeah, this could be the one. This person feels like you're the one. Good things are just around the corner. Listen to your inner voice, okay? Pay attention to the red flags. see we have oh cheaters so this person may have been cheated on in the past that may be the reason why they feel so apprehensive like they feel like they need to take it slow because things could change at any moment right um but i feel like this person is yearning they're longing for you they they want this connection to grow and to flourish right we have a uh, step into a higher vibration. Good things are happening. And healing to create the perfect time to reunite. Wow. This person may be... Yeah, they're tired of being apart. They want to be together. They want to have you all to their self. And we have you have to let go... So that something better can come. You know, I feel like that's this person's anxiety over, you know, past events. You know, they have to let go of that so, so that something better can come around. Something better can flourish, right? And we have uh, ask and you shall receive. Beautiful. We'll, we'll get one more. And let down your walls and be open to opportunities. 
So I, I feel like, you know, this may be your energy or this may be someone else's Capricorn. But I feel like letting down your walls in this situation. Be open to love. Be more open to receiving love from this person or for someone else. Um, it's going to bring you more opportunities, more, more ways of, of getting love in return, right? So let's get a timeline. Excuse me. Yeah, let's get a timeline for... No. I'm all over the place, Capricorn. Forgive me. Let's get some tarot. We'll get some tarot and then we'll get the timeline. Messages for Capricorn. What's going on in this connection? Give me more messages for this connection, please. Okay, the Two of Swords. There's some kind of decision that needs to be made. There was definitely some kind of betrayal in the past that someone's having a hard time not thinking about. But I feel like this person is working on the situation. They really want things to work out because they have a lot of love for you, Capricorn. They're kind of pouring their emotions out here, right? They're having a hard time controlling exactly how they feel. They definitely want to offer you that cup. You know, this could be that knight in shining armor that you're waiting for. And they're, they want to bring you a solid offer, a commitment. They want this, this situation to escalate into something bigger, something better. You know, they can't get you off of their mind. They're thinking about you a lot. They want to win your heart at all costs. You know, that this person actually fascinates, has fantasies about moving in with you, about living together, about what your life would be like. You know, I feel like you bring this peace to this person, right? I feel like you and this person are going to move into a more calmer place, a more positive place, right? You're moving into something better. You're moving into a better situation. Okay. So now we're going to go ahead and get that timeline. What's going on with Capricorn? When will this relationship escalate? When, when will Capricorn start feeling this connection? When will this deepen? Close your eyes. And feel what you want approximately three months. Right. Set your intentions out there. I feel like once you really set your intentions, it may move to two months. Right. For some of you, this is two months. So definitely beautiful energy. Beautiful energy, Capricorn. This person really cares very deeply for you. They want, they want to win your heart at all costs. You know, they don't want to, you know, leave without you. They want to take you with them. Okay? So let's get an angel number for Capricorn. What do we have for Capricorn? What does Capricorn need to hear right now? Okay, 1818, optimism. Be optimistic. Raise your vibration. I believe we said that, you know, a successful manifestation of your abundance is near. Higher levels of optimism are needed as new abundant beginnings are on the horizon. Brighter days always come after the darkest nights. Okay, so Capricorn, your affirmation. Everything is in perfect order as I enter into this new, into this next chapter of my journey and connect to the abundance that is near. Okay, let me read the affirmation one more time. Everything is in perfect order as I enter into this next chapter of my journey and connect to the abundance that is near. Okay, so have optimism. You know, be patient in your situation. Let it flow and grow and... Um, form naturally you know don't try to force anything capricorn okay so i hope this reading helps you if this resonates please like and subscribe if it doesn't resonate take a look at your other placements and gemini my excuse me you may be dealing with the gemini capricorn 
uh, Capricorn, my, my wonderful Capricorn. Until your next reading, many blessings, love and light.